Welcome back, lords and ladies of the small council, to another grand adventure in the life of Gendry Baratheon, bastard of Robert Baratheon, and true heir to the Iron Throne. In the last episode, we picked up some Baratheon warriors. We got this saucy damn helmet wherever I am. Hold on, I should be in the infantry line somewhere here. Uh, there I am. My beautiful... Oh, that's not me. Damn it. I can't find myself. I'm just trying to find myself, man. Uh, why is Arya assigned to the cavalry? That doesn't make any sense. She is an infantry fighter. Alright. Infantry. Front line. Should have pulled Arya out. It did. Cavalry there. Archers in a loose formation. Spread them out a bit more. It's not working how it is supposed to. Alright, random horse archer back there. Uh, this dude, I believe all of my guys are like an infantry type unit, so they should all be in the infantry line. They are my personal bodyguard. Alright, infantry, charge forward. Got some outlaws to kill. Look at this beautiful helmet. The beautiful bastard that I am. Alrighty. We've got some Kingswood Outlaws ahead. They do have infantry this time, which they didn't last time we fought them. Assign the cavalry. I'm actually kind of keen to get in into the new update of Bannerlord. They've added the ability to target specific units. So say I wanted to run my cavalry into only attacking the enemy's archers. I can order them to do that and they will as much as they can, ignore the enemy infantry outside of defending themselves. Which is absolutely awesome, and I love that change. I can get my archers to focus infantry or enemy archers in sieges. It's it's really cool. I'm a big fan. That's really, really cool. I like it a lot. Cool changes coming to the base game. Also the ability to, like, work with your um, workshops much more. Wait, no, no, no. Cavalry shouldn't be in shield wall. Oh, just took an arrow to the face. Get the infantry in shield wall, since they're marching slowly anyway. We may as well have them all holding shields up, ready to defend themselves. The cavalry should... Right, cavalry's providing a distraction. Go, 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 go. The enemy archers will turn their attention to the cavalry. Go, 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 charge! Go forth, warriors! The great army of Bullrath! The great Baratheon army moves forward, ever stronger. Ah! We've got to take a city and rename it Bullrath. I don't know if you're allowed to rename cities, I can't remember. But we must, that, that's definitely on the list of things to do. Go lads, go! Get on top of those archers, they're a problem. I'm with you, Northern Colonel. I shall push you, push you ever onward. Charge, my meat shield, charge! That's it. Soak up all the arrows for me, lad. Right, we're in. Now the bandits die. They face the wrath of Gendry this day. Whoo! Quick win. If you guys are enjoying this content, please do me a favor. Drop a like, drop a comment to help with the algorithm, and subscribe if you're new here. We are doing constant content and I love making it. Look at Cregan! This pacey little bastard, he's sprinting after him. Heavy in heavy armor, shield, sword, he doesn't care. He's he's faster than I am. Oh, not quite. I am slightly faster. Well, maybe not. He is kinda outpacing me. I gotta get a little bit closer and BAM! Nice. Only one man escaped. Indeed, Cregan. Oh moving on. We lost a couple men, nothing too serious. We've got 41 prisoners, all of which are bandits. Um, got some cows in here, some hogs. We'll get rid of them, get some food. Uh, we have a lot of, like, good produce that we can sell. Obviously, we want to keep our blacksmithing materials, but everything else can be sold. So, let us make our way back to friendly land. There's a lot of Kingswood outlaws around here. 
Oh, there's 50 of them. I'm not sure if we actually beat that just because of uh, archer numbers. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to cancel my changes. Thank you. Pause. Run back. Right, let's have a look. He's got 29 infantry, 21 range. Okay, so it's not too heavily in his favor. Screw it. Let's go in. Oh, we're going to pull in another group of them. This could be really good loot-wise. We might lose some more men, but loot-wise, this is going to be awesome for us. Archers, take the front. I'm not sure if our archers beat their archers, to be totally honest, but we're going to try. I want our infantry in the back line here. Cavalry will move to the flanks. Archers are firing. I want them to pull forward. Infantry, I want you behind in a shield wall. That's it, men. Shields at the ready. Hold your line. We're drawing the enemy in. Their infantry approaches. Prepare to meet them in battle. Alright. Infantry, form a line and charge. Nope, charge. Archers, pull back. Our cavalry is doing good damage to their bandits back there. The enemy infantry stopped their charge, but they are recommencing now that we're going in. Oh, crush those two. I will name this hammer Storm Crusher. For it crushes the storm that is not raging by Renly's. By Gendry's side. It will be the thing that crushes G good old Renly. Traitor to our father. Plotted to steal the throne for himself the second his brother died. And robbed Lord Gendry of his well-deserved throne. Move infantry. Get on top of them. Take the archers. Shields at the ready. Moving up with Arya and Izzy McSquizzy over here. Izzy McSquizzy! Oh no, he's been killed. Izzy McSquizzy is down! Avenge him! This is for McSquizzy! How dare you harm McSquizzy, you foul cretin! He is a great and noble man, and you shot him in the face with an arrow. It's fine, he'll recover later. Because logic. Alright, dead people. Uh, one Dragonstone Footman... Uh, one Northern Archer. See, he's only wounded from that arrow to the face. He's fine. He's like Shahodun from, like, Three Kingdoms. He just takes an arrow to the eye and he's all good, bro. Don't worry about it. That eye will make a full recovery. Uh, we're gonna go some Ironborn Axe Masters. Westerlands Banner Knight. We're gonna get some more Westerlands units so we can get a Westerlands Companion. That would be very, very good for us. Uh, get a Stormlands Bow, White Harbor Elite Knights, we'll get some Dragonstone Squires in here. Nice! Our army is definitely growing into an extremely effective one. We don't have the same struggle we do as Lord uh, Rob Rain in our other campaign. Gendry has a much easier time slaughtering his opponents. His army is far stronger. I'm surprised there hasn't been a new war pop-up, to be totally honest. Is, um... Did I turn off static wars in this one? I don't think I did. Still a quick save and just have a look. Save. Is static wars off? Options. Mod options. Arm of Thrones. Uh, Kings protect the Night's Watch is on. Night's Watch may not war. Free Folk may not war. Custom Party AI. Uh, Night's Watch Free Folk. Static Wars. Oh, I've disabled Static Wars and it applied to this. Well, we want this on for um, for Gendry. And we turned it off for Rob Rain because as the Westerlands, you're fighting um, everything at once. You're up against, I think, near six different factions, which is kind of rough. As the North, we kind of enjoy the fight with the Westerlands that we're having. Ooh, Mage Mormont got old. Damn. Nuns deep. Ooh, that's a that's a lead up to a bad joke. 
Um, let us gather with the armies of the north. We'll run in and pick up some extra recruits from around Castly Rock. We might be able to finally make our push uh, to finish off the Lannisters here. Obviously, once we take this, we still have to deal with um, their King's Landing. Which, honestly, if we get enough influence, we might lead our own army to take King's Landing, as it is our birthright to hold King's Landing. Um, let's jump across to High Rock. There is an army besieging Castly Rock. We're going to have to go and investigate. Ooh, that's a lot of men. Uh, there's only 144 men inside the rock. It's not really holdable until that army comes back to help. The, La the Lannisters were given time to recover their army. This will be a difficult war. Oh, take us to Case. We've got stuff to sell. That's why we're so slow. Um, tavern. Prisoners. Get rid of them. Recruit. There is nothing to recruit. Trade. Get rid of all of our excess stuff for a quick three grand. Get rid of all this loot. Uh, bows. Weapons. For now, we need the money more than we need the uh, smithing. So, we're going to... Prepare for war. Five, those 500 men are whittling down. Oh, but they've taken it. Castly Rock remains in the hands of our enemies. He's traveling to besiege Craig Hall, which is where? Where is Craig Hall? Is that one of the ones over here? Craig Hall. Craig Hall. Where is that? Hornvale. You're going the wrong way if you're going to besiege Craig Hall, ma'am. It's over here. Uh, we, we need to be on our toes a little bit, try not to get caught. But if we can, we've got to maneuver ourselves. Oh, God, that's scary. All right, their armies are heading the other direction. We need to try and loop around and try not to get caught by this massive army. We need distance. Much distance is needed. They're sieging the crag. They're sieging the crag. There is a crag in the wall. Um, crag, again, doesn't have much of a defense. Howland Reed is gathering an army. Might be beneficial to join him. Is she coming to help? She's going to besiege Castly Rock for the 13th time in its life in this game. Um, how far off is Lord Reed? Okay, he is coming. He's going to gather near Horson. Which is where? You're going to gather way down there. I don't know about that, Lord Reed. I don't know about that. Right, let's go join him. Much depends on this war. Actually, before we join him. Before we... Oh, dear Lord. That was not working. Alright. I wanted to go and gather men from Iron Bay and Bane Village before we join him. Get some more cavalry on our side as we are going to be short on cav against the Lannister armies. That's for sure. But if we steal some of their cavalry and pair it with our own White Harbor Knights, we should be in a much better position. Yes, Lord Reed, I'm coming. Panic not, your savior has come. The crag has fallen. Back to uh, House Craig Hall. That's unfortunate. Are they sieging case? Not yet. Uh, Kenos... Did the army that attacked Castly Rock fall? I think it did. Lord John Umber. Small John Umber. Not large John Umber. Oh, hello there. It's a lot of dudes all gathered up. You know, I think if we all join forces, we win this. Get in there, lads. Get in there before their, their allies turn around. Alright, I am with you, Wyman Mandalay Of House Mandalay. Warriors of the Trident, we are with you. Actually, I'd like to keep my men in reserve, to be totally honest. It might be greedy, but I don't want my men to die as much as I want their men to die. <laughs> um, cavalry should be delegated. Yep, cool. All right, pull our infantry in. I want them in here, but I don't want them to throw their lives away. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do, to do with my archers. 
I want them to skirmish behind the infantry, while our infantry acts as a bit of a rear guard. Yeah, they have 118 knights on either side of the field. Definitely not preferable. Whoa! Warriors! Shield wall! It's your only hope of holding back the cav. Move! As a large bunch of dudes. Alright, I want my archers to get down there quickly. They need to run for it or they're going to die. Infantry, get up here. I might lose a few back there, but the important thing is that we get into this infantry battle. Oh, here we go. This is bad. The enemy cavalry is coming. Prepare yourselves. Hack at them. We're getting surrounded. I can knock down horses all day, but I need some support with it. Infantry, get in here. Ow, lots of damage. Lots of damage. Lots of spearmen. I'm going to die here. Our infantry are doing a good job of holding them. As many as we can anyway. There is a lot of horses in here. Oh, that was our own man. Kind of confusing. Take him out, lads. Take him out. Right, we appear to have screwed a majority of the enemy's cavalry force. Infantry! Hold your formation tight. Hold together. Warriors of Bulrathian! Break the enemy! Their infantry's at it. Now it's just their cavalry force. We should be faced with another large cab charge here soon. Hold the line. Hold the line. Here they come. Take them out. They ride in and we'll knock them down. Knock that man right off his horse. Keep pushing. Unite with our allies. Bring down any man that dares charge this formation. Holy damn, we're just... We are the mountain. We are just murdering horses left, right, and center. Ow. Man just smacked me right in the face. You lot... Break shield wall. Our allies kind of just like bugged out here. They're, they're, they're like, okay, we killed the enemy infantry. We're good now. We're still marching forward. Go on, infantry. Go get those archers. Go. Get them. Get the cavalry. He's picking up extra axes. Well, I think the enemy cav's done for. They appear to have lost. House Lannister will remember the day where they were crushed by what they would refer to as an insuperior force. Insuperior? That's not a word. I mean, it might be. I don't know. I'm not all that educated, okay? Australian education will only take you so far. <laughs> a lie. We actually have a very good education system. I just wasn't very good at it. I spent all my time playing video games. Hunting down enemies in great strategic battles. Alright. What have we got? What's left? Not much. Three horsemen. You'd think they'd be breaking by this point. That guy is screwed. Oh, maybe? No, he gets out somehow. 
Why won't y'all just retreat? Come on, charge me. My hammer will crush your horse's skull. Come get some. Come get some. Ah, oh, their last guys left are commanders. That's why they're not breaking. Take him out. There we go. Lord Craig Hall is down. Lord Serret is down. Victory for the army of the north. And we lost Beckle units as well. That's actually awesome for us. Um, take these guys. Take the Riverlands soldiers, the Westerlands knights, Riverlord house guard, mounted warlord, champion. Damn, we got some good units. White Harbor knights, Westerlands gallants. I don't want no Bolton unit. Get that out of here. Get that trash out of here. White Harbor Squires, Northern Sergeants, Northern Warlords. We're not over the limit yet. Let's just keep grabbing dudes. Everything except the Boltons can come with us. Yeah, get out of here, you Bolton scum. No one likes your kind around here. Damn Bolton. Uh, those are some really good shoulders. But, like, I mean, I suppose I'm wearing Jon Snow's one right now, which, I mean, it's not really <laughs> mine, but... I was about to say, it's not mine, but I'm not wearing what should be mine. <laughs> I gotta go pick up some more Stormlands gear once we have more money. That stuff's expensive, man. And someone did ask me why uh, I didn't pick up Renly's armor. And I'm gonna tell you right now, it's because Renly's armor's damn expensive. Right, it was like over 200k for his armor. Now, that's just one piece. I didn't buy it because it was way too expensive to be buying. Mega pass on that one. I'll look into it once this war is concluded and the Lannisters are wiped off the map. Once we are more of our own man, you know what I mean? Let's wait it out. Let's do a um, tawny battle. We may as well. To the tournament! Join the tawny. A broad two-hander for the victor. I do like two-handers. I mean, it's a sword. So it's not really my thing, but... Hey. Any two-hander's a good two-hander. I believe one of my companions needs a good two-handed sword. Ah, bring it, fool. Yeah! Club him to death! A bloody Lannister knight. Mace combat. Give me a two-handed mace and then we will talk, alright? Uh, okay. Game glitched out a little bit and just, like, wouldn't put the weapon down. There we go, he's down, alright. I had to beat that guy or I don't get through to the next round. Now I just watch these guys fight it out. Or I come in and tag team and try and wipe out the, uh... Guardian of the Rock. This is like two tier six units fighting. Yeah, yeah, what's up? Yeah, I get my stamina back, and you just lost yours. Oh no, I'm I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. Woo! I thought I was dead there for sure. I blocked that perfectly. Lies. Damn it. All right. Next round, we still get the the payout because we didn't technically die. Who is riding with us? Rob Stark has deigned up, deigned to grace us with his presence. Lord Rob Stark. Lord of Winterfell. Oh, one guy's already down. I gotta find that guy's teammate and finish him off. Oh, yeah. Take that. Whoop, missed him. Hit him. Gendry's not exactly a cavalryman, so, uh... Tournaments in Lannister area, in the Lannister area, aren't really his strong suit. Give me the tournaments in the, uh... In the, 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 the Northern Kingdoms, 100%. Those guys do a lot of two-handed combat. Or even the Wildling tournaments, they're pretty good too. Whoop! Nope, oh, nope, nope, don't wanna die, thanks. I'll pass. Sorry, going this way now. The 
goal is to take out as many dudes as possible. Only problem is, I'm terrible with a lance. It's called a lance. Hello? Ah! Last the longbowman is down. Alright. Pull the mace. Oh god, this is horrible on horseback. It has no range. Which is like the primary facet to horseback combat is having a weapon with some range on it. Alright. Let's do it. Uh, we're gonna we're dueling Rob Stark. This could go very poorly for us. Come on, Lord Rob, King in the North. You think you can defeat Lord Gendry? Your father was no match for Rob, for my for my dad in his prime. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Maybe the ta turns have tabled. Genetics have backfired. Aha! 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 Yeah, what's up? Oh, oh god. Oh, no, no, please. Please, mercy. Lord, please, mercy. Have mercy on me. I am but a poor peasant boy. Ah! Oh, oh god! Yeah, okay, we weren't all trained by Lord Rollerick. Calm down. Give me a damn two-handed hammer. That fight ends way quicker. We still got him, boys. We still got him. I was actually trying to kill his horse there force him into uh, ground combat as he is oh he's a Westlands duelist so he doesn't have that much horse skill either gotcha ah not quite damn this man's got his shield up at all times just stab his horse until he decides that he has to attack. Oh, didn't have his shield up that time. Maybe he's going for a mace. I don't think I want to fight him with a mace because I think he wins that. Give me some speed, horsey. Charge! William! Oh, we goofed it. Ah, see, we shall do mace combat. Okay, he's just, oh my god, sir, please. Oh, the range on this thing is horrible. I hate it so much. Oh, I'm getting dizzy just doing this. Ow! All right, you know what? This is not a way, this is not how you win this fight, sir. I'm telling you right now. That's why, dickhead. Get out of here. Yeah, you don't want me off my horse. I'm far better when you take me off the horse. Bring it on. Alright. Tawny concluded. Anyone to recruit here? No, not really. Alright, nice. Um, let's check out inventory. Who can have a nice two-handed weapon? Uh, Thoris Paynes, an axe boy. Kragen, Arnleder. Arya's got needle. Uh, Krieg and Whitecross. I think he should be a Chad boy with a two-handed weapon. I mean, at one point he's going to be wielding um, the Whitecross blade. So, for now, giving him a broad two-hander should help develop his skills. I like it. Alright, where do those armies go? Helen Reed is going to besiege the Crag. Andrew Locke is going gathering, I guess. What's going on here? Is he being engaged? Oh, he was being engaged, but he lives. Whoop, there's an army. Hey, Locke, come and help, bro. We win this if you join. Oh, nope, Locke has no interest in helping our ally. I'm just gonna ride alongside the armies and hopefully not get caught. Ooh, spooky. Spooky, spooky. Uh, you're going to get attacked. Uh, what about that was a smart idea, sir? Uh, we don't win this. Damn it, Lord Reed. We tried thinking. You dumbass. 
Yeah, come on. Come and attack my castle. I guarantee you it does not go as well. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Punk. Okay, he, uh... He really just wants to kill me. Can I run past him? Will that work? Go, 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 go. Right, can I gather manpower around me? I can get Lord Tallheart. I can... He's going to take freaking four days to get here. Mega Kerwin. Jeez, everyone's so far away. Mira Reed. Everyone is very, very far away. Don't like it at all. Lord Tallheart, thank you for joining us. I wish to come and assist Andrew Locke, or Andrew Locke. Because I know that the only Lannister army that's coming is not big enough. Oh, we have 413. Their allied force that's coming could beat us here. Should we leave? We should leave. I'm sorry, L Lord Locke. Stop there, stranger. Oh, I poo. That was not the plan. Um, I challenge you to a duel. I think not. Our armies will clash in battle. Okay, so our reputation precedes us, and he knows that we'd win in, in a duel. Uh, what's he got? Is he a heavy... He's probably heavy cav, right? 68 cav, 213 infantry. And we are 126 infantry. Yeah, see, I don't like this. Maybe we try to get away? Could lose 46 men. It's either we try to get away, or we guaranteed lose our units. No, we try to get away. Yes, Cregan, I'm sorry. Listen, we didn't have many options there, bro. You know what, Cregan? Next time you go fight them all, okay? You got this. Damn bloody show-off with his cool damn name. Martel Blade... Bronze Blade, Valyrian Steel Blade, Lion Tooth, Iron Wood. Do I have White Cross unlocked yet? I think I do, but it costs, um... It... Oh, I don't have the White Cross Blade unlocked yet. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm looking at one-handed. Uh, two-handed sword. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yeah, there it is. It requires 10 Thamaskine Steel. Which isn't really optimal. What we can do, though, is... Uh, go to the tavern in here. We're going to visit it. Alright, here we are. We're at the local tavern. Fear my blade in the tavern. <laughs> Alright. We're going to leave the tavern. Roam about the city of Case. Uh, Lord McSquizzy. Get all my other companions. Bring them to me. We're going to go clear out some uh, scumbags that live, that live in the city. Oh, luckily there's a group of those scumbags just down here. Craig and Arne Ladere, join me, sir. Northern Rangers. These are, like, most of my men just, like, chilling in the city. Thugs! I'm doing what I want. I don't take orders from you. Oh! Oh god, sword! Need to draw sword! Oh damn, Craig got messed up. Not prepared for thugs, I guess. Oh, get wrecked. Uh, leave it empty to help the town. To own an alley, you will need to assign a suitable clan member and some troops to watch over it. This will provide Denas to your clan, but also increase your crime rating. I don't want to be a criminal. I'm happy to just annihilate all crime in this city. That's my plan. Because I, I don't know if it still works this way, but you used to be able to just run in and, like, kill a bunch of, like, these criminal organizations. And when you did that, you could get, um, like, guaranteed, like, or almost guaranteed, the Maskeen steal ingots from, like, the reward pool. But I don't know if that's still how it works. Small child. Where are my companions? Are they coming or what? Should have a dude bringing in, bringing me more companions. Izzy McSquizzy, follow me. I need you, Lord McSquizzy. We have work to do. How many dudes are up here? One, two, three. 
That's the same amount. We can do this. Hey, you. Doing what I want. I take orders from you. Yeah, that's right. I already killed one of your groups. Happy to take another one down. Ow. I did a lot of damage. I forgot I'm not wearing armor. Lord McSquizzy, the talent on you. The blood in your eyes. Leave it empty. Poxy Peter? What a name. Oh, aren't we talented folk? We're just running around, murdering gangsters, living our best life. What are you going to do? Cut my He literally will cut my hair. Interesting. It's been a long time since I ran around inside of a town. Any more peasants to kill? No, I think I think we got all the criminals in town. We did a mission here before, I think. Alright, nice. If we wait, do we still get, like, the clash with the, um... With the gang? No, we don't. Okay. That sucks. That really sucks. Um, so, how do I get Thamaskine Steel, then? What's going to be the most reliable way for Thamaskine Steel? In the base game, there's like a specific weapon you can just buy and smelt down. It's really cheap. It's like the dagger. That's a Thamaskine Pike. I mean, you would imagine that from a Thamaskine Pike you could get Thamaskine Steel. Let's try it. Um, smithy. Um, refine. Give us some charcoal. That's not going to give us the masking. It's going to give us fine and normal. Are you kidding me? That's rude. Makes me sad. Can't believe it. Buy him flint. Got a lot of, um, like, upgrades and stuff there, though. So that's nice. Lord Kenos. Can we capture this guy off guard, maybe? Come here, buddy. Yeah, got him. You know we're at war. Surrender or die. We're going to bring in the local militia as well from Pendrick. Very nice, very nice. Oh, it's a little bit of a bridge battle. I don't really need the cavalry for this battle. I think this is a straight just charge the infantry and let them do their job. Infantry, go forth and crush the enemy. Great warriors, charge the enemy! Actually, they do have cavalry, so we're going to have to split up our cav. Get up the hill! I think they're guaranteed to charge us in this type of environment, so what we do is form up right there. We could have held the other side of the riverbank and just destroyed them there. But I'd rather fight them in town here. Man, move up. Shield wall. His horse is very weakened. Enemy cav. Trying to do things. Getting slaughtered amongst my line. Now what I want to do is move our line up to here. Go, go, go. Axe throwers, throw your axes. Oh, that looked like it sucked. Let's try and help out our uh, White Harbor Squire over here. I got you, my lord. Get these horses out of my way. I must ruin this man. There we go. You cannot face me, my lord. My warriors are far too good at this. Here comes another one. Ugh! Oh, that poor horse, man. I wish it didn't have to be this way, but it does. Alright. Infantry, break up and charge. Shield walls no longer needed. This is the part of the battle where we just wreck dudes. 
use our superior infantry to finish them. I'll just club the death, club most of them to death. Bam. Right, Castly Rock guards down. Yeah, what's up? How dare you try to rear charge my men? Yeah, you want some too, do ya? Come and get some! Well, the guy didn't actually go down, but his horse sure did. Bring it! Oh my god. Oh no. Bro, it would be a bad time to be a, a Lannister cavalryman when you're facing this army. <laughs> just the, this one madman with a hammer that just keeps killing all the horses. Mess them up, boys! Crossbows are down. All they got left is horsemen. I don't even know how many of them they have left. Like, one? Yeah, they have one horseman left. Excellent work, lads. Excellent work. Cleaned up one of their... One of the armies of theirs that was slowly preparing to more than likely join up with the main forces of House Lannister. In this case, we're going to steal recruits. What we could do is issue a raid here. I want all your recruits. Nice, thanks. We must bolster the forces. We're going to take back the crag. That's our goal. We have double the men. We can do it. Also, our men are, like, far superior. Oh, no, do we even have anyone set to do things in our army? No, we don't. Uh, I will be the steward. Uh, Lord Cregan... Uh, Thoros Payne is the engineer. Cregan can be our medic. And we'll set Cregan on Ladare as the scout of our party. This should work out a little bit better for us. Hopefully we don't get attacked while we're preparing for this siege. That would really suck. Oh! Reinforcements! Yes! Warriors have gathered to assist us! But we'll actually be able to claim the crag as our own if we win this. Because we're initiating the siege. Which is awesome. Oh, we're building little siege towers! I love these siege towers. You get to straight rush up them and just destroy everything in your way. It's great. Wait, I'm not in command. Excuse me. I started this attack. I'm the guy in charge of building the siege equipment. How can I not be in charge? Okay, so I have to leave and come back. Otherwise, it's not going to... Otherwise, it won't, like, actually initiate. There we go. Oh, and suddenly we have, like, a thousand men here. I was going to claim all the glory for myself, and these guys had to show up and ruin it. Welcome, everyone, to the Siege of the Crag. The armies push forward. The archers begin firing their shots. The enemy catapults loose their fire. And now is the time to strike hard at the enemy. Jace over there must be manning one of the catapults. He's getting lots of kills. Oof. The archer fire is unrelenting. I'm excited for our siege rams and our siege ram and uh, siege towers to make their way to the wall, because then we're just going to charge up and win. Most of our losses will be sustained on the outside of the wall. Sorry for that brief pause. I had to have a sip of my coffee. Lady Whitecross makes a lovely barista-made coffee. She's a qualified barista, and it is delicious. She spoils me. How much damage do I do to barricades? I know I shouldn't. Holy damn, I like half health it. Okay, that's a thing. Fun fact, I can remove my own barricades. I don't need to, but it's a cool thing to know. Alright, go, 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 go. Make a break for the tower. I'm ready, lads. If you march with me on this day... We will bring glory to the Northern Realm. No damned Westerlands bastard will dare stand against us today. For we are the North, 
and we remember. Winter is coming, lads, and we need to get our southern holiday homes locked in. A little bit glitchy because I'm standing on it. That's alright. Alright, I'm prepared to charge. The walls will be ours. Charge! Shut down the catapult! Got him! Take the gatehouse! No more firing your damn bows at my men, sir. Incapacitate them, lads! They're not ready for the amount of power Lord Gendry brings to the, to the battlefield. Shut down the catapults. End the enemy's lives. And bring victory to our warriors. I'm saving many lives right now. What is this guy doing? It's the most elaborate escape plan I've ever seen. It failed, but goddamn, was he trying? Alright, we have now swept the wall. It's time to move our way down the stairs. What, like this? <laughs> and ninja into the enemy's forces. Sometimes having a couple Lannisters in my army is kind of confusing, but it's fine. Hack them down, lads. Show them why we are the superior army. Because we have hammers, and you do not. Lord Jace is down. The enemy's warriors from this side of the wall defense are coming across. They never even got to stop me. I just charged straight into the gatehouse. Oh damn, they still have men back here. Charge! To the front line! Where Gendry belongs. I will cut down anyone who gets in my path. You damn ninny boy! Anyone else in here? Anyone on top of the tower? No. No, there is not. Huh. My acrobatic skills. They are showing once more. Yes, men. Cheer. For we have once again conquered the crag. Some recruits. Very nice. Don't mind if I do. Give me some of those guys. I don't want the militia because they suck. Nice. I deserve this castle. I did all the work, right? I did all the siege preparations, and Galbert Glover over here comes in and claims the damn castle. That ain't cool, man. That ain't cool. Uh, small John Umber is 19 hours away. He's 15 hours away. Sure, let us gather some warriors. Could we take Kevin Lannister's army? I mean, we should be able to. Charge! What do you want, stranger? I want to end your life. We're at war, surrender or die. Fight me. Alright, men. One final battle for the episode. The great battle of the ages. Kevin must fall. Uh, increased damage against mounted troops, plus 20%. Well, you're my cavalry commander for this campaign. Horse archers, you guys just, just do what you do best and be annoying. Heavy cavalry, defend our flanks. Infantry, push forward. They have 58 archers, which is kind of scary because, well, we have 20. And we know that the Lannisters like to use crossbows, so that's a problem. Is it a better call for us to, like, hold position, like, under the ridge, maybe? I don't know, but I'm still running at them because reasons. Uh, they hold the opposite side of a river, which is not good for us. Alright, I need my infantry down here now. Down you go. Archers, move down. We still need to draw the enemy into taking us on, not the other way around. We do not want to fight them on their advantage. Enemy cavalry. Looks like they were coming to engage us, but our cav has finally arrived to intercept them. Right, I need my infantry. D 
to get up here because we need to form up in a really annoying position. Right there, in a shield wall. Archers up here on this ridge in a spread out formation. Be as annoying as you possibly can be. I gotta try not to get shot by archers because I'm being scoped in on. They are aiming for me. Bring it on! I take down horses for breakfast. This is what I was born to do. They clearly have learned because every single cavalryman there just decided to not fight me. He's like, nah, we're gonna ride around that guy. He's a problem. He has a big hammer. He hits hard. And correct they were. That's it, man. March forward. Krieg and Whitecross with his two-handed sword that we gave him just decapitates a horseman. Absolutely ruined that guy. Uh, bam! There goes your horse. Yeah, now what, bro? Now what? Nah, no, 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 no. Don't touch my... Don't touch... Don't be touching my archers like that. All they did was their jobs, bro. They don't deserve this treatment they're getting. Right, infantry, you can't actually get into the position I sent you to get into, so just attack. Um, oh! Arrow to the chest. Line formation, so you're performing better. In melee, go, go, go. Brush the enemy. Break their line. Roll them and sandwich their forces. Now charge the archers! Finish them! Charge! Are they running? Are they trying to retreat? Oh, nope, they're just skirmishing. Don't let them skirmish! Get on top of them! I will kill as many of you as I have to. To ensure that you are not skirmishing my men. Now I'm behind you, so you don't really know where to go. The cavalry has come to my aid. I'm still being shot by a crossbowman somewhere. No, 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 you die, sir. This dude over here is still trying to skirmish. Get out of here. Our horse archers doing their jobs, their duties. Come here, you bastard. Come back. Come back. Don't you walk away from me. Every time you leave. I lose a little piece of me. Whisper, whisper, Mr. Lannister. I'm gonna mess you up. Come on, get your fat ass over here. Eh, eh. Almost. Almost. Ah! Got him. I caught him, guys. I caught him. Oh, the enemy still has cavalry, apparently. Two of them. Three of them. One guy there. Two guys over One guy over there. He's just dead. They're dead. Okay. Quick, charge me! I'm an infantryman! On my own! I'm the best target, I swear! Oh my god! My cavalry dude said, no, you do not get a horse anymore. Oh, that guy's done for. Hey, you! Take this! Got him! Excellent work, lads! The banners... Of House Bulrathian fly high today. Our great Stormlands recruits fighting hard to prove their worth to their new king, Lord Gendry. Whew, Kevin Lannister, you are my prisoner now. Thank you, sir. I'll take all of your troops as prisoners too. Gendry is a benevolent man. They will be sold into slavery. Alright, um, I want Ironborn Axe Masters, Stark House Guards. Damn, there's a lot of upgrades we got to do. Uh, we're going to go Stormlands Bashers. White Harbor Knight Commanders, obviously, because they're superior. Um, we're going to go Riverlands Men at Arms, Stormlands Fell Knight, House Tully Men at Arms, because they look so damn cool. Um, Dragonstone Halberdiers, because why not? Alrighty, not bad at all. Get some Lannister levies. Yeah, we get some Lannister levies. Alright, look at that. Like, we're losing a bit of money because of our army is extremely advanced now, but, I mean, it's worth it. It is genuinely just worth it. 
Ooh, cows. We have a lot of food too. 73 days worth of food right now. Damn. All right, everybody. That is going to wrap up this episode. I'm glad to have been here with you. I love you all. I'll see you in the next episode. Subscribe if you're new here. Like and comment for the algorithm. All that jazz. Bye for now. Not forever.